All Recording right. in progress. We're doing this, you guys. We are on. <laughs> okay, hey, hey, Nicole. Hey, Melissa. We are on day seven of seven ways to earn money, to make money from your phone. So let me know, have you guys been following along the seven days? Let me know right now. Let me know if there's something that stuck out for you, something that, that applied already, something that you applied, maybe you already started making money from your phone. If so, let me know. You guys, this has been a, such a fun journey this week and I just wanted to share my intention for this whole seven days in case you're just joining. And basically my intention was, I think we live in the most exciting time ever in history in terms of opportunity, in terms of staying empowered uh, to make money in so many ways. So really, I just don't want anyone to ever feel stuck in any capacity, okay? So I don't want you to feel stuck because there's so many ways to make a little bit of money and also to make a lot of money and also to have multiple streams of income, okay? So today is episode seven of the seven. So if you haven't already um, tuned into the other episodes, you can catch them on IGTV, you can catch them on YouTube, you can ch catch them on Facebook, they're all over the place, okay? So definitely make sure you catch them and apply uh, this advice. All right, so episode seven, saved it for last, we're diving into investing and a cryptocurrency, Note, I am not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. I will say that a few times, but no, I'm not a financial advisor, not financial advice, but I'm gonna share a few things with you. Um, and if you wanna hear from someone who knows way more than me, that's my husband, comment below. I'll try to drag him on. All right, here we go. So before we get started, let's start with the affirmation that we've been rocking all week long. I hope you guys know it by now. Okay, Diane, Nicole, do you guys know it by now? Okay, here we go. Repeat this affirmation after me, word by word. Ready? Money comes easily and frequently from expected and unexpected sources and in ever increasing amounts. All right, so have a, an affirmation that you're working with to so stay in the vibration of attracting goodness and abundance to your life. I've been working with that one for 15 years. Absolutely love it. All right, so for episode seven, it's investing and it's about putting our money to work, putting our money to work for us. Now, the reason why I saved this for last is that the thing is you need extra money to, in order to be able to invest in anything, right? So episode six, I shared our largest income source for our family, the largest income source that we have for our entire family. And that income source has allowed us the extra money to be able to invest. So that's awesome, okay? So that's that. Now, here we go. So for our episode seven, we're gonna talk a little bit about cryptocurrency, and I know this is a hot topic, but over the last year or so, um, Mike, thank you, honey, <laughs> my husband, he has been diving in in terms of investing. So he's making our money work for us. Once again, not financial advice. But I'm gonna share the notes that he shared with me to share with you. But before I do, I do want to highlight something for you that I think is important just in terms of the subject of inv investing in general. And that is ultimately, I really hope you guys are investing in yourselves every single day through personal development, through books, through podcasts. You know, you, the return of investment on yourself is, is really the greatest investment of all because as you learn, as you grow, you share that with others and ultimately that's the legacy that you're, you're leaving, right? That's what you're passing on to your children and to the people around you. So make sure you are investing in yourself. All right, I'm gonna pull up my notes here on my computer because once again, not an expert and neither is Mike, but he did pull up some um, notes for me to share with you and he, has um, really dove into this topic and oftentimes I'm walking into a room and I hear I'm learning something from some crypto expert, you know? So here we go. So the two links that I shared with you, if you're on Facebook right now or you're watching it on YouTube, there's gonna be two links below. If you're on IGTV with me, just hang tight. And those are for the currency exchanges that we use here in Canada. So one is for, one's called Newton and the other one's called BitBuy. Okay, so 
Newton is great because it's very mobile friendly and this whole series is called how to make money from your phone, right? So we really do love Newton for that capacity and also it's really great for newbies. Newton for newbies, okay? It's really great for beginners. And then the second crypto exchange that we want to share is called BitBuy. So once again, the link will be below here. And this one is also great, but it's more desktop friendly. Okay, I think they do have an app, but it's more desktop friendly. Okay, and for our US customers, um, or for a selection of co coins that are not available in Canada, there's Kraken, um, and we do not necessarily recommend Coinbase, um, but here's the basic rules that Mike told me to share with you. Okay, you guys ready? Okay, here we go. So again, I, I this is not financial advice, this is just some guidelines that he wanted me to share with you. So here are some basic rules. So take the time to understand what you're investing in, okay? So how many hours, so Mike has invested such an incredible amount of time in researching before he invested our actual first dollar. So this is not something you want to go into blindly. Um, luckily, there is so much information online and just like anything, you have to, you know, look at your sources and find reputable sources that you want to learn from online. There's so many of them. And again, if you want to hear more from Mike, just based on his experience, comment below and I'll see if I can drag him on. He also recommended that I share with you guys to never invest more than you're willing to lose. That's really good advice um, because crypto is, it's highly volatile, right? Just um, in terms of short and midterm risk. But the truth of the matter is, and the beauty of crypto is that if you zoom out, you'll see when I zoom out looking at like the graph, right? If you're looking at short term, you'll see how volatile it can be. But if you zoom out, you'll just see the upwards trend, right? In terms of it being a potentially good investment for you and a potentially good return on your investment. Um, and I love how Mike really, Mike really approaches our investing too, because it is a, an emotional, uh, there's emotions involved, right? So we really have to manage our emotions when we are investing as well so that we are you know not reacting as much to fear or greed and just really having a really stable uh approach like mentally to it um but all in all it potentially could be something for you guys to look at as you can tell i'm choosing my words very carefully but as a family we are we are really excited about this space and we do see a lot of opportunity and potential in it and also just with individual coins. Um, so it's not like what, I only knew of like Bitcoin, that's all I knew, right? Um, but there, there's different coins doing different things in this space. And I think ultimately it's like, first of all, it's really overwhelming at first, but if you wanna start learning about crypto, um, I highly recommend learning about it, right? And definitely learning before you invest. And um, it's there's gonna be a learning curve for sure. And if you, again, if you want to learn from, from experts, there's so many online. Um, one tip that Mike gives when he's talking to people in terms of how to do your research, he actually recommends um, investing in uh, YouTube Premium because that way you're getting rid of the commercials and you can just find like the sources that you want to learn from. And a lot of them have daily shows, even twice a day. And we tune into them. <laughs> I'm usually with him. And, uh, and we, you can learn from them without all of the ads and such. So that's what we wanted to share. I know it's not like the full picture again, because we're not financial experts. This is not financial advice, but those two uh, cryptocurrencies could be, uh, sorry, crypto exchanges could be where you wanna start, especially if you're in Canada, and we would highlight Newton and BitBuy in terms of where to start, okay? Uh, again, we're not recommending Coinbase um, just because there's been a lot of things that we've heard um, and read about, about the, the terrible customer service potentially that they've had in the past, so maybe skip that one for now. All right, you guys, this is seven episodes, seven ways to make money from your phone. And this is another series that I've completed. And I think the next one is either going to be about manifesting or how we eat plant-based as a family. Not sure yet, but lots more coming. And thank you guys again for being here with me. We'll talk soon. Bye.